Hello everybody and welcome back to another one of spectacular episodes of Avo Gaming. Today we are playing Dark Forces Part 1. That is right. Today we have gone back to... Well, we haven't gone back because we haven't even started yet. But we are going back in time to these classical games. I was actually brought up with these. Fair enough, I am only in age 19 at the minute. But these were the type of games that I actually got brought up with when my big brother was playing them and I was sat alongside him and while he was playing his games... I was watching and I kind of was playing at the same time. So this is kind of like a childhood thing for me. And yeah, I'm wanting to go back and play these games. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this. So I've actually got all the Star Wars games, all the old ones, all the first person shoot ones and the third person. So basically all the Dark Force series, which I believe went on to like Jedi Knight and all that. Just to fire, so I will be doing every so often an episode of these old games, and I will actually be going through them all and completing them all. So, yeah, hopefully, everyone will enjoy this as a new thing for me, and it's like reliving my childhood, I guess, of the gaming industry. So, Dark Forces, this is the first Star Wars game in the actual game series of like the era this is set in. So, I've already created my character, my agent is what I am known as, Avo, yes that's right. I had a bit of trouble actually playing this game at the start, as loads of like blue bars kept popping up when I was picking up stuff when I was trying it out just so I could set it up for recording. But I've managed to suss it all out, I've managed to actually get full screen, it's actual full screen, that's right, full screen, yes. Standard for every game, but at the start because it run on actual DOS, it wasn't very good. So, set my agent up, mission, secret base, let's go, let's begin the mission. Now. Prologue Mission 1, The Death Star Plans, Operation Skyhook, Phase 2. We'll just set it to medium, just so you know. I don't know who this woman is here. But anyway, confidential message from Senator Mon Mothma. The Rebellion is counting on the completion of this mission. Commander Katarn? Oh yeah, Commander Katarn. I hope success is on your side. Background. Can I scroll down? Okay, right. The Death Star plans are locked away at an Imperial secret base on the planet Dunata, where they await transport to Lord Vader. Very little is known about the layout of the base itself, so I'm afraid you will have to act as your own reconnaissance. Yes. The mission. Once you have the plans, get out immediately. Operation Skyhook. <laughs> I'm miles away there, I didn't see the full stop. Operation Skyhook will deliver the plans to Princess Leia on the Counselor's ship Tentative 4. Is that number 4 1v? Yes, it is number 4. She will then continue the mission. Mission objectives. Find and retrieve the Death Star plans. Return to your ship on the roof of the base. Okay, this isn't too hard. I actually do know this mission. I did do it previous, but I've set it all up again. So, yeah. Okay. I'll oh, listen to the music. So, yes, look. This is a first-person shooter. To say this was done in God knows what year. Probably the 90s. It has actually got good graphics. So, oh, God. I didn't see him there. Okay, I think when I actually did this game originally, I did it on normal difficulty. So, let's go. These are shield units and things I've just picked up. And this is a... like a machine gun blaster. I actually forgot the names of all this stuff, so I'm just going to jump on here. Get some energy units and some shield. Now, at the bottom left is like your health indicator and shield indicator. And the bottom right is your ammo. Yeah. I'll just try to find. Oh, I think I may have just pressed something there by middle mouse clicking. I don't know what it does. Controls on. Oh no, it's just the music. So, right, open this. You need the red key. Alright, no problem. I'm guessing I'm going to have to use. Nope. Yes. There we go. So, some stormtroopers. I don't actually know how to look up and down. You can strafe though. But, yeah. I think there must be a way you can get like an auto aim thing on. Oh. Didn't notice him there. Yeah, I know there is a secret around here. What are these here? No, nothing. You can jump on this game. <laughs> you can jump, you can crouch. So yeah, people mainly knew this as a updated version of Doom. Apart from it was set in the um, Star Wars universe rather than the Doom universe. Which I believe Doom is on Mars, I believe. And in the Doom games he was after his rabbit, I believe. Oh god. So yeah, that had a bit of a dodgy storyline, but this is actually set in the Star Wars universe. And everyone loves Star Wars. I mean, if you don't... Oh god, wrong way. If you don't love Star Wars, then there's something wrong with you, I'm afraid to say. There's something must be wrong with you. I'm a fan of Star Wars. 
So, right, I know there is a secret, like I said, I'm just going to find the secret just so I can show everybody. And it's to do with one of these very dark places. <laughs> you have to go up somewhere. Alright, I think this is the dead end one. There's two little holes that you can go in. That's one of them. I say little, they're quite big actually. And this one is the second one. This one is the actual right way. There's a little bit of a jumping puzzle. You have to jump around, get some more shield. And this is a revive, I believe. Yes, revive. I don't know what the revive is. I'm guessing it's just like an automatic revive. And I believe if I'm doing that, I think I've actually got the red key. I'm not 100% sure. Let's, let's just go and try. Let's get back in here. Let's see if the door will open. Yes, it does. Right, this is a lift. Oh, yes, look at that. Nice stormtrooper there. Another one there. Oh, didn't see him behind me. Can you, can you get through here? What's my crouch kit? Right, crouch is C, so can you jump crouch? I don't think this were really implemented into this game. No. Um, there might be a way in there. I'm not 100% sure. Now, if I press I, does it give me mouse aim? No. P? No. O U I L K L? No. Nope. Never mind. I know in, I think it was Doom, you can shoot that little droid there, but I'm not sure how you can actually get it. Because I can't aim down. <laughs> Maybe someone could tell me how to aim down? I hope. Yeah, I, I don't know how to aim down. Um, it's one of the same, like I say, it's an old game, so the controls really aren't the best. But in Duke Nukem, there was a button that you could press which put aim mode on. Let's just try it in the options, actually. Let's go configuration. Um, calibrate joystick. Oh shit, no, 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 no. I haven't got a joystick. Okay, never mind that. Let's, let's just continue. Right, I noticed stay button. Here we go. Press that. And then doors open there, right in front of me. I'm going to see if there's anywhere else I can go. Doesn't look like it. Nope. So it looks like down here then. Here we go. This is the next part of the level. Now, this level isn't very short. But what I will be doing, I'll be doing like an episode per level. So, what's that? Oh god, I don't think I pressed that before. <laughs> um, I honestly don't think I pressed that before. Was you meant to press it? I don't know. I just know there's quite a Ow! Ow! Where did he come from? Yeah, that was like an assassin. That was a stormtrooper assassin. We have like some kind of weird galaxy map. Or is that the Death Oh, that's the Death Star. Is it the Death Star? Looks like Death Star. Look at that. Hey, hey everybody, I'm inside the Death Star. Yeah. Yeah. That was the enjoyment of this level. I was inside the Death Star. But everyone right now is wishing, oh, I wish I was in Death Star. Oh, the Death Star looks so cool. I want to be in the Death Star. Well, no. I own this game. I was in the Death Star, not you. So, right, that's opening that there. What's through here? Die, everybody. Oh, and you. So right, what's, what's through here? That's a lift going upstairs. I think the next level on the upstairs is actual... This oh, is too easy. Death Star plans. I get to my ship. Ah, so right, I know if I go through the other room that is the end. So I'm just going to go up here, up these stairs. No, it was up here, wasn't it? Back up here, because I think there was another door somewhere. What's this door here, look? I, I've got an itch on my tab. One second. There we go, itch gone. So right, where, where's this lead me to? Okay, this leads me up as well, I didn't really want to do this. Oh, it leads me onto that little platform. Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't do this in my last playthrough. I just thought I'd go back just to see if there's anything else. Now, looks like just some pickups, nothing really spectacular. I don't know if there's like secrets on this level. Why is that door closing? Okay, the door doesn't want me to go back. Let's open it. What's this over here? Huh. Ah. God damn it. <laughs> I'm guessing you could go over there, that's the Oh, God. Right, that's it. I'm going, um. Yeah. Secret hunting right here. I should have looked over there at first rather than just rushing off. Silly me. Where was it? Around here? Through here. There we go. That, that was like a speedy movement. If I fail this time, I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> um, oh, God. So, right. Is, where was it? Alright, it's over there. Um, let's go. Shit. Okay, never mind. I missed. Forget it. One more attempt. Third time look at. Come on. We can do this. We can do it. Right, come on. Where was it? Nope, around here. Oh, God. Come on. We can do this. 
Right, let, let's go. Last attempt, last attempt, and then we'll actually complete the mission. Huh. Yes, I made it and there's nothing over here. Huh. Right, I did notice there's something over here, like the other little platform. Let's go. No! Never mind. One last attempt. This is my second attempt at that one. <laughs> I managed to do the other one. Sorry about this, you may want to skip a minute if you don't want me to see do this. But no, I will do this. So yeah, just, just keep skipping. Oh, I made it look. Oh, yes. It's... It's... Done much. Oh, oh, I found another secret here, look. It's very dark, I cannot see. Oh, what's this? It's a door. Is it a door? It is a door, yes. A door that won't open. Oh, look at the light in effect. Okay, why won't the door open? Nope, the door doesn't want to open. Never mind, I'm sure there's nothing that important in there anyway. Why doesn't it want to open? Do I have to like shoot something in here? Like that over there? Has that done anything? Um, okay, I'm slightly confused with that. Never mind. Forget it. Let's just finish the level. <laughs> I don't want to be faffing around too much. So right, which way was it? Up here, down here. I have retrieved Death Star plan, so we'll be able to blow this sucker up one day. No spoilers. There was no spoilers right there. But one day, I think we will. I think us being the goodies, we will stop these baddies. I think. I'm not 100% sure though. You I mean, we might already know if we do. I don't know. But anyway, we are now on the rooftop. I'm being shot at by this guy behind me. What a douche. Appearing behind me like that. What's this? Oh god, that made me jump. Find a secret. Extra life. Yeah. Oh, that's, oh, that's the start of the level. Oh, of course, I found another secret right there. Wrong way. <laughs> there you go, look, that's another secret found. So, do you get like so many lives per level then, I'm guessing? No, nope, this way. But yeah, it's like amazing here. I mean, the level design on this game is just amazing. Mission on. Uh, mission. Mission objectives complete. Oh, look at my ship. Yeah, that's right. I'm like bigger than the actual wing. I can jump through the wing. So yeah, press escape key to end mission. Oh, next mission. Oh, look at that. Mission goal complete. Continue to the next mission. Yes. Kyle delivers the plans to the Rebel Alliance. Soon afterwards, the Death Star is destroyed. But even as the Alliance celebrates this victory, another sinister plot is set in motion that will become an even greater concern for the Rebellion. The Emperor has approved your test demonstration, General Monk. Thank you, Lord Vader. What I unveil today will mark a new era for the Empire. We will be able to decimate the Rebels just as we did the Jedi Knights. At last, the Emperor's war will be filled only with the glory and beauty of decisive victory. A noble cause, General. I hope the demonstration lives up to your claim. Proceed. With pleasure. Dark Trooper, release. Very impressive, General. The Emperor will be most pleased. Continue with your project. Certainly, Lord Vader. Thank you, 
Commander, for responding at such short notice. The Empire has been keeping us on the run since the destruction of the Death Star. Five days ago, the Empire attacked one of our secret bases in the city of Talay. This is Tech Base to anybody out there. Please, we're under Imperial attack. There were no warning at all. Total devastation. They broke through our shields. They broke your shields. Tech Base was destroyed within minutes. Many innocent people in the surrounding city, as well as the rebel staff, were killed. Intelligence thinks that this may be an act of retaliation for the destruction of the Death Star. Interesting. This looks like it could be a normal Imperial attack. Except for those sounds. Very perceptive, Commander. I know you understand that all we discuss here is classified. This Imperial officer, Crix Medine, wishes to defect to the Alliance. He has supplied us with information on the development of a new Imperial weapon. Those sounds you heard, we believe, come from that weapon. A new type of Stormtrooper, the Dark Trooper. A new Stormtrooper that can take out a Rebel base that quickly? I should have kept working for the Empire. The Rebel Command is not taking this lightly. They have authorized me to hire you to find out if there is a threat, and if there is, to shut it down. That is, if you are still on our side. This could be interesting. Alright, I'm in. But I think I'll need some help on this one. I want Jan Ors as my mission officer. Certainly. Then I will let Jan brief you further on your mission objectives. Thank you, Commander. And may the Force be with you. All right, yeah, that was some crazy cutscene right there. So the second mission is to lay attack base. But for that, we are going to end the first episode right here. It's just an amazing game. <laughs> it really is amazing. And it really is reliving my childhood of games. Yeah. So, yeah. I hope you have enjoyed that. There will be more coming up. Like I said at the start, I'm wanting to like go through all, well, the majority of old games that I got brought up with, be it whatever like genre of game. So as I said, the first-person shooter. Obviously, the other ones do develop more into a third-person slash first-person with like the switch activity that you can do. Switch activity is that even a word? It's probably not. Never mind. That's my made-up word for the day. Switch activity. <laughs> So, yeah, I hope you have enjoyed that. There will be more coming. Don't you worry. There will be plenty coming. So, I hope you have enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, favourite, comment. I'll read your comments. If you've got any games that you are wanting me to play, old games, new games, anything like that, then just, just comment and I'll see what I can do about it. I've only ever had one request for a game to play and... I did it and that was Torchlight 2 so yeah any comments they're all welcome everything is welcome that you do even if you have some criticism I take it on board so hope you enjoyed watching that thanks for watching take care guys and I will be seeing you next time